Interestingly enough, even the Centers for Disease Control, which is the, uh, the uh, standard cancer treatment people, what they're essentially saying is about 80% of the chronic degenerative conditions we get, including cancer, result from stress. Emotional issues we go through, uh, experiences, traumas, all kinds of things. We know that our emotions have a, a deep and profound impact on our immune system, for example. We know that when we feel stressed, it has a detrimental impact on our immune system. It actually causes greater pathology. So we need to come into harmony and balance between the mind and the body. So the separation of the mind-body is really the deeper cause of the issues. And that's also the deeper cause of, uh, you know, wanting more, <laughs> consuming more, yeah, owning more, yeah, fighting more, controlling more. So all this energy is causing more stress. Yeah, more stress in this body, but also more stress in our life and causing more stress on the planet Earth. And that's everything, you know, all the challenges we're facing, all the crisis, you name it, the whole big list is the expression of that stress, that separation. We consider that the body is like a tree that grows, grows on the ground of the mind. So the tree, which is the body, cannot be healthy if the ground is also not healthy. So the ground of the mind has to be made more healthy. And stress is a poison. Uh, when a patient is diagnosed with cancer, I go with them through several psychological factors. Stress is one of them, very important. Second factor I see a lot in the consciousness of cancer patients is resentment. Resentment of not having been what I uh, expected to be. Resentment because people didn't consider me or don't consider me as well as I think. Resentment that uh, uh, something went wrong. But this resentment is, has a bit the quality of anger. But anger is like a flare up, very big, you know. You cannot sustain anger for more than a few hours. You will be exhausted. But resentment, so it's like a fire, big fire. Resentment is more this anger sustaining time, a low grade of fire. But this will break all your mind and it will break your body. And possibly the, the most important part in all this uh, mind work that you have to do with a chronic disease patient or a cancer patient is that they become aware, not so much to solve it, they become aware of the content of their consciousness.